Developing now, a sold-out concert turns into a crime scene. CBS2 has learned a woman was sexually assaulted last night at the Foo Fighters concert at Wrigley. Lauren Victory is live outside the ballpark as the band gets ready to take the stage again tonight. Lauren. Hi there, Erica. Well, doors for the show just opened. This portion of the line, people have been waiting a couple of hours to get inside. These fans can expect to see more security in light of last night's incident. Now, we have some video from the show last night. By all accounts, it was very fun, but it was also, there was also a report, a very serious report that came from police. They say a 23-year-old was sexually assaulted at the Wrigley Field concert. She told investigators that a man grew Roped her while she was waiting for food around 9:30. That woman left the line and came to porter potties that are uh, situated by the right field entrance. Before she could lock that door, the man forced his way inside and sexually assaulted her. Now, to put tonight's fans at ease, security will be ramped up by those portable restrooms off of Sheffield. Guards will monitor guests coming in and out of that area. Now, back out here live, another look at excited fans. Want to also tell you that. Police do not have that suspect in custody. They're still looking for him. And as part of their investigation, they are reviewing surveillance video from Wrigley Field last night. That is the very latest here in Lakeview. I'm Laura Victor reporting live, CBS 2 News. Erica. Okay, Lauren, thank you.